Hi friends, welcome to penhouse.in. In today's video, we are going to make a short review on Airmail Vality 71JT Mini. And this is that model. This one is a, a brown color marble finished cap. And in the top portion, there is a silver color uh, button and uh, this clip portion which is so sturdy. And you can hold in any holder and the pouches easily. And there is a long silver color uh, clip or a ring here which denotes the 71's model and in the name uh, in the ring portion there is some engraving like uh, manufactured by airmail airmail pen co dot yeah the branch name validity was engraved here and here comes the nib this is number 8 nib and the feeder also so strong uh, you can for this pairs you can prefer our uh, refer our uh, pen or store inside we are having uh, a different uh, brands different tipped uh, number 8 nib with different colors also like dual tone or a uh, full golden plate gold plated or the full silver one and this is so soft and smooth grip portion in which you can hold this for a long time this won't give any pressure to your fingers and this is very good grip portion uh, thread portion which holds the pen so safely and here comes the inner threads uh, don't fill the ink above the inner threads you can find inside and if you feel that uh, about that inner threads you can get, you will get a very scratchy writing and and also the overflow you can apply silicone grease or vaseline over here over this thread portion for a better life and and the one more important thing in maintaining your fountain pen is especially in eyedroppers you have to wash this with water at least once a week because uh, if you're using a dye based ink like uh, our turquoise blue which means our penos ink our brill or uh, a day tone or a suleka like that uh, in long run they will precipitate in the nip portion the feeder portion itself so this will give a, a scratchy writing and uh, the ink flow will be blocked so you have to do this uh, shake this shake your pen simultaneously means the flu fluke frequently so this won't give a very uh, good writing so to avoid these problems you can uh, better wash this with water the process is so simple for the pens like this you can easily dismantle and wash it with water and this won't take that much time but this process will give a if you did this you, this process will give a long run to your life uh, which means your pens life so for that you can hold this tightly and twist it and pull it this is a simple process and so you can wash this easily so now I'm going to give a writing sample for that I am using our Penos Violet Color Ink which is also a dye based one. Here I am dipping in the ink and drawing the excess here. Yeah. The nib is writing so smooth, exactly a butter flow. Yeah. Then about the nib tuning, if the while manufacturing the new branded pens will have some scratchy writing or uh, the ink flow may not be equal. For that you can uh, tune the nibs. The process is so simple. You, for that you can use your nails or you can use small, uh, small knives too, and you have to do this you have to uh, move uh, pull and push the both tines up and down for this writing is so good and for uh, for exam sample I told you so if you did this the, you will get a very good ink flow and uh, the smooth writing too and if you have any query about this pen you can ask in the comment section or else you can contact us in whatsapp you can uh, find our whatsapp number in our site itself so 
We are there to respond to you at any time. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.